Question number four also has us adding two polynomials, but this time we're going to add a trinomial with a trinomial. As always, we want to start with each polynomial in standard form. So for this first polynomial, the largest exponent should come first, which is negative 2 r to the fourth. Then the next biggest exponent would be 8 r squared. And then I have my positive 4 r. Then let's take our second polynomial and again write it in standard form, lining up our terms vertically. Negative 5r squared, or r to the 4th, can line up with the negative 2r to the 4th. The 6r lines up with the 4r. And then the minus 6, the constant, goes on the end. So be really careful when you're lining up your like terms. Sometimes you'll skip some places, like here, there was no r squared in my second polynomial, so I don't have anything to combine with that. Now we just add them vertically. Negative 2 plus negative 5 is negative 7. So my first term is negative 7 r to the 4th. 8a squared doesn't have anything to add to it, so it's going to stay as 8r squared. 4 plus 6 is 10, so we have a positive 10r, and then a negative 6 on the end, which makes our answer negative 7r to the 4th plus 8r squared plus 10r minus 6. And again, you can just click that answer right here.